So, Gunner got released from jail after taking a plea in the YSL gang case. According to the rapper, he's still maintaining his innocence and stressed that he is not cooperating with prosecutors. Hmm. So, they gave him a deal. I think it was five years. And then one, he's been served already, so they gave him time served for that. And then, supposedly the next four years, I guess he's got to be serving some type of special commitment or some type of special deeds he still has to do for the next four years or if he gets caught up with any type of charges, pretty sure felony charges, then he can go back to jail. Did he snitch? Because he hurried up and took that deal. And if you pleaded to the Rico case, he pleaded guilty, then you're basically confirming what they said about Young Thug. So... Did Young Thug get sacrificed for Gunner? Because now the evidence shows that, oh yeah, they just going to put, just blame everything on Young Thug. And they just doing two more ridiculous, dumb charges. In one of his plea statements, he went all the way out of his way to say that he did not said that he did not consider it a gang, more like a group of people from Metro Atlanta who had common interests. Hmm. Did he really say that? What y'all think? Did he snitch or not? He left a statement saying that despite taking the plea deal, he will not be cooperating with prosecutors further. Hmm, further. So that kind of means that he was already cooperating. I don't know. Then he also said, well, I have agreed to always be truthful and I want to make it perfectly clear that I have not made any statements. I have not been interviewed, have not been cooperated or have not agreed to testify, will not be a witness for or against any party in the case. And absolutely no intentions of being involved in the trial process anyway, he said. Hmm. What y'all think? 